Hello, everybody. I'm Ryu Shikaze. He's Liquidy Poo. Um, yeah, hello. Uh, and this is Dawn of Sorrow Randomized. Uh, last time I killed myself because I was in a stupid dead end. Now I'm exploring a little bit more of the area around that dead end. Yeah. I had actually totally forgotten about the boss like lead up that ended up being a save. Yeah. <laughs> so in this one, uh, having mostly explored this area, I, I decide uh, now's probably a good time to, to check out some of those areas I've been ignoring previously. Aha! Uh -huh. So. We are Time. headed, uh... Oh yeah, here's me being... Indecisive. indecisive. Yep. Yeah. So <laughs> Specifically, this was... Wait a second. There's something missing here. I don't know if you could see it, but it was literally... As I was looking for where to, to go, I was thinking, maybe I should go to the... Wait a second. <laughs> is that a... Is that a doorway? God damn it, I'm an idiot. A single doorway. Oh, it's got a soul box. Yeah. <laughs> oh! <And it's>... Yeah. <laughs> the, the thing <laughs> what we need. Yes. So this is me going, alright, uh, let's <laughs> see, where all do I need to go? I'm thinking, okay, I know there's a couple mirrors. I know there's one up top. There's obviously the one down below. I think there's one in this area. There is a box in the map I see that isn't clear directly to the right. Yes. That's actually nothing important. I go I go to check that uh, much later. Uh, oh. And it turns out it's just the very edge of one of the boss arenas. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, that's where we fought uh, uh, laser braces. Yeah. Okay. What a great name for them. Laser braces. <laughs> oh, yeah. Nunchaku. Yeah. Completely useless, but just fun. One of these days we'll get that spin double. Yeah. <laughs> I do eventually. Uh, w would you like some spoilers as to what his uh, drop is? Let's yeah. see. Spin devil, generally pretty useless, so I'm going to guess he got something somewhat important. Uh, well, yes. Uh, not specifically his soul drop that's really good. It's oh. only okay. His item drop, on the other hand, is the Satan ring. <laughs> Which All is, right. Unless you're getting the unlimited MP uh, thing, basically the best uh, accessory in the game. Yeah. Oh, we get one shot guillotines. Yeah, we've been able to one shot guillotines for a little bit. Oh, okay. Um. Um. Yeah, no. It, I think it was the previous episode to this, I hit the stat threshold of uh, being able to just do enough damage. I bet I commented on it then, too. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> so what are we... Uh, we're looking for more mirrors? Yeah, at this point I'm thinking, is there another one in here? But I'm basically I'm realizing, wait, no, I think it's just the ones that are, that I know of. Though I think I do find a third one later, but that's in a place I haven't explored yet. Aha. Uh -huh. Um, it's interesting, uh, trying to remember my thought process uh, as I play through this. <laughs> or as I watch back through this, because I basically did uh, 
a huge chunk of these all in a, in a big one sitting. And I'm trying to <laughs> remember yeah. my exact thought process. Which, you know, half the time I probably didn't even have one. Man, e even with uh, simple half-hour videos, like in the RE2 LP, I had no idea what I was doing. I could watch back a recording <laughs> immediately after recording it, and I was just like, what the hell am I doing? <laughs> what was I thinking? But yeah, I think... Yeah. At this point, I think I'm headed up and to the left uh, to get the mirror in the Lost Village... Then oh, yeah. I'm headed into uh, the underground clock tower, as I as I shall call it. A subterranean timekeeper. Yeah. <laughs> what in? Is that a spoiled tin can or yes. rusted? Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, more Draco. Good. Yeah, the bottom of that other village uh, screen. Still gotta clean yeah. that up too. Yeah, I think I think I decided to do that. Um... As, as part of this. Alright. Yeah, this is... As this was the start of one of my sessions, it essentially is the... Alright, let's poke around a bit. Oh, I see. Oh. The, uh, that top room, that's definitely a mirror. I remember yeah. that. Yeah. Waiter, there's a Soma in my curry. <laughs> What's he doing? Uh, Dominion? <laughs> yeah, here we go. Br yep, Brass Knuckles. Awesome. <laughs> yeah. Good. <laughs> I, I think my thought process right there was all that for Brass Knuckles. I can't say I'm surprised. All of this for a bit of brass. Yeah. <laughs> that is such a bad barricade. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I assume it has to do it by getting stuff from the surrounding tile set. Yeah. But, yeah, it just looks terrible. The, the ground one does not work very well. No. <laughs> Poor creature. Shattered on nothing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no. This is actually this for being so weird as where its placement actually a very important uh, section of the map for me. Hmm. Cuz uh this actually has a lot of uh very very useful souls and items. I see. I do like how the Castlevania 1 reference zone is going to be completely scrambled and no longer a legitimate <laughs> reference. Oh yeah. Do you ever use the uh, magic version of just your basic weapon swipes? Oh, uh, I do sometimes. Uh, usually I'm thinking I need the, uh... Um... The mobility. 
Because the final sword one, it just takes such uh, a long time to come out. Oh, okay. And then some of the other ones, like, bizarrely, like, uh, the Volman Way doesn't have one, I don't think? Oh, weird. Yeah, I think it's just because hmm. it's so useful as it is, because it comes out so fast, doesn't lock you into place, and, uh... Um... Uh... You know, can hit multiple times. Yeah. <laughs> Booer. Great. Hey, you're just gonna let that whack whack tree live? Of course I am. It's not bugging me, you know. It oh, takes you, me you longer. <laughs> yeah, no, uh, it takes me a, a bit to remember. Wait a second. I have Zephyr. <laughs> and it, like, for some reason, I, I think I got myself confused with, um, like, Aria for a second, where you need the, uh, the, the, the other soul, and not the Zephyr soul. Hmm. Um. Actually, I don't quite remember that. Uh, so, Aria has the... I was trying to remember what it is, like the the Clockmaster Soul, I think is the name oh, of it. Oh, yeah. And you need it to get into the area uh, in the lower right. <laughs> oh, wait. Yeah. This is me going... Wait, I thought I... And then I didn't see it, and so I'm like, did I <laughs> not pick it up? And then, like, a little bit later, I think I see it uh, in while I'm scrolling through, and I'm like, oh, how the hell did I miss that and, like, immediately beeline back here? <laughs> to be fair, I missed it too, actually. Yeah. I was I was looking for it. I just didn't see it. Yeah. Yeah. Is it the whack whack tree making that constant noise? Yes. <laughs> Yeah, no wonder. I think that... Oh, go ahead. Yeah, I, I think it's supposed to be the sound of it growing the the imp fruit, mm -hmm. but I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah, this is another one uh, that it expects you to the the cutscene expects you to come in from the other direction. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I, I guess if I had been looking at the map, I would have known it would be a dead end. Yeah. Oh! It's the level three of those guys, I think. Uh, yeah. I think they only show up... Well, they might show up in the clock tower, too. It, they, they are, like, some of the most randomly placed enemies. This group. There we go, that'll get him. Sick of slogger shit. <laughs> Everybody's sick of slogger shit. 
Oh, what about the left? Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> I do think I come back to check on it, and it's nothing uh, particularly notable. Oh, okay. Um, oh, you jumped it this time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One of the, the changes made in uh, the later versions of this uh, randomizer, uh, mm -hmm. literally the version after I generated the seed from, is that the uh, drawbridge now stays down permanently? Oh, that's that's handy. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, more mirror stuff. I forgot. Yeah. Also. Uh, I think I was also um, thinking about water stuff, because I'd cleared out one water room. And then there's uh, the second one, yeah. That I had forgotten about, and I'm like, what's up the- oh wait, water. So, I think that's what I'm about to head to right now. Hmm. Oh, I didn't see what he dropped, but nice. <laughs> yeah, I uh, wasn't paying super uh, close attention myself. I'm sure oh, I... I can go back and look on the yeah. footage later. We have two soul jars in here. Yeah. Man, even <laughs> even with the uh, break it with weapons thing, it's still tedious. Oh yeah, especially because I have to uh, hop at the right moment. It's a lot easier coming back down. Uh, there we go. If I did not have the double jump, I don't think I would have been able to do that. And all that for, for a, a damn barricade. Yeah. There hasn't been a single uh, breakable wall, has there? No, not that I've seen. And I, I did go through around later and and look around for them off camera. Hmm. Um, so yeah, I might have just gotten a weird seed that didn't have any. Yeah, it's interesting, nonetheless. Damn jelly monsters. Yeah. Is that the first Gaibon we've seen? No, it's not the first one, but they've been much rarer than the Slowgros. Mm. I think we've seen another one in um, the underground, the mines. Oh, okay. Ooh! Oh, you already had it. <laughs> yeah. I picked it up from a... A previous video. <laughs> yeah. Specifically the visit in, um... Uh... The, the, the Abyss. When I was oh, doing yeah. uh, the PG-13 Geiger. Ooh! Ooh, I see that sickle. Yeah. Oh, it's a throwing sickle, though. Yeah, it's not Death Size. I don't know if I actually pick up Death Size at, at any point in this. Hmm. Um. Which is a shame, because I think it's actually... Though I think it's slightly weaker than um, uh, the final sword. It attacks faster and has a longer reach. So it's yeah. technically the best of the uh, the heavy weapons in the game. 
uh, if you can't find the Clive Salai. I seem to remember defaulting to Death Scythe a lot. Yeah. But yes, now that we have the proper mirror one and I've explored a bunch of other places, let's go kill ourselves a Fireboy. Yeah. Time to and, defeat uh, Agni, Lord of Flame. Yeah. Agnes. A Agni's just a nickname. Mm. Yeah. No. <laughs> The, b the best way to infuriate a demon, call him by an old lady's name. Oh, it's <laughs> Agnes! Keeper of the Flame! <laughs> How's your grandson doing, Agnes? Man, he still do, do, thinks do, do, do. everything is really funny. Yeah. He, he, he knows one joke. <laughs> and that joke is fire. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. By stats, I'm probably uh, way under-leveled for this, but Agony is so predictable that... I can probably, you know, I figure, eh. Yeah. With with some healing items and, you know, taking this a little more seriously. And if I remember not to randomly hop. Mm -hmm. I think most of my damage in this fight comes from uh, reflexively hitting the jump button as I dash. Yeah, jump up into his his uh, fire donger. Yeah, or or his uh, claws as I'm looping along. Cause mm -hmm. I just forget how the the hitbox of them. See, uh, Don doesn't give you any elemental absorbing gear, does it? No. That's unfortunate. I mean, I, it does give you some resistant stuff, but nothing that straight up um, absorbs fire, for example. Yeah, nothing, nothing straight up broken. <laughs> yeah. Like equipping the lightning circuit for uh, um, Galamoth. Yeah. <laughs> God, I love that barrel circuit. Yeah. <laughs> Though... It's also super, uh, just super satisfying to take him on as Maria. <laughs> uh, I think I have a video on a, like, a Twitch channel that's just me for about eight minutes straight just hitting square, uh, cause after I get into the right position and manage to stun lock him so he <laughs> cannot do anything. Are we talking the uh, uh, the Maria added to the uh, like the PSP? Thing? Yeah, the PSP version. Okay. He's actually even easier to beat as Maria in the Saturn version. I really want to play the Saturn version, but uh, you know, <laughs> yeah, it is it is uh, a mess to emulate, uh, and even if you have a Saturn, you have to have the right Saturn. Yeah, or have modified it. And on top of that, I I do not read kanji. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah, I, I don't read kanji, so that's also a, an issue. Also, Celia, we know the game isn't over. We don't have a credit sequence rolling right yeah. now. <laughs> Sure thing, Ojo-sama. Also, I just missed the, the Zephyr soul on that screen. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. 